Captain's personal log. Sylvia Trent. Do I really need to say my name? The name's on the fucking computer screen when you're logging on anyway. Anyway, anyway, okay, anyway. Fucking start date, you know, January 20, it's only two days later. The 22nd, alright? Okay. We still haven't arrived at first contact planet, because the thing's halfway across the fucking galaxy. You know, first mission, they're like, oh, why don't you go next door? No, they couldn't do that. Bloody Admiral whats face sent us all the way across the galaxy. You gotta dodge one anomaly. You gotta fucking tell uh, this Klingon ship that you're fine. You, you're just passing through. It's just, it's, it's, it's chaos. Anyway, regardless, I was getting a bit bored, so this morning, I decided to take a tour of the ship. I decided to walk around, see what's going on. I went to engineering. Talked to the engineer, I did this and I did that, and I went to the holodeck. I thought, alright, what about, what about, what, what, what say, I go into the holodeck and I chill out a bit. Maybe I go to the beach. No, I don't like the beach. Maybe I go to the pool, swimming pool. I don't like sand. Fuck that. You know, you get that shit all over the place. No, thank you. You go to the beach with a bloody sandwich, you get sand in your sandwich, and then you're chewing on rocks. No one likes to eat rocks, alright? Unless you're a, a rock-eating fucking alien bugger, but, you know... That's you. You do you. If you're a normal person, you don't eat rocks. Alright? Okay. So I'm thinking, okay, let's go to the holodeck. Go to the holodeck. Program's already in use. Program's already in use, but the bloody holodeck door's locked. I'm thinking that, wait, wait a minute. Wait a second. This isn't protocol. You know, you gotta, you gotta open the fucking door. At least unlock it. I'm the captain. So I override that. I'm like, override. I'm like, that's what I say. It's a computer. Override. And I'm like, oh, yeah. well, you know, well, the computer's all like, you know, you need to, you, you pass code and what have you. It's like, yeah, whatever. Anyway, I go in shocking. Bloody shocking. All right. Fucking four. There's four of them. Bloody four crew members and it's just absolutely shocking. They're half naked. You know, for starters. All of them. Bl bloody half naked. All right. Ah, uh, it's just uh, so sweaty. Just, it was horrifying. I've never seen anything more, you know, just disgusting. Honestly, the sweat, the panting, the screaming, the ah, you know, the, the what, what are you guys doing? Bloody hell, it's just ridiculous. They all look at me shocked. You know, the, oh my god, the captain's come in. He's caught us at this inappropriate time. It's just shocking. I'm like, excuse me, who the fuck authorized you to play tennis in my holodeck? Bloody tennis! Fucking tennis! What a shit game! I swear. And there's four of them, and they're playing fucking doubles, alright? Everyone's taking their shirt off. Bloody half naked motherfuckers, alright? And they're sweating everywhere. It's just ridiculous. They're hitting those balls. No, 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 no. Not on my ship. Not on my watch. Ha! <laughs> no way. Fucking tennis. Ridiculous game. It's just a. It's just an offensive. It's an offensive game. I'm sorry, it's stupid. Alright, you run around from one side to the other, whacking a ball across the fucking court. What what kind of game is that? Alright, that's not... No, that's not a game. That's just stupid. Alright, you whack one ball one side, and then you gotta whack it the other, then you whack it again, and then you whack it again, and you know, it takes a fucking day to count one point, and then you gotta do it a million other bloody times. Because you know, a, a game of tennis takes fucking months. It's ridiculous. No. No, like the only thing bloody worse than fucking tennis is cricket. Alright? But you ain't got no room to play fucking cricket on a holodeck. Or at least, you know, I've, well, anyway. I, uh, I told them, you're, you're, you're all bloody, you know, outrageous. Finish your game, even if it takes you fucking 17 months. But whatever. Alright? We've got a mission soon, so please, you know, clean up. I left. I just had to leave. Ah, bloody shocking. Ah, oh, just offensive. I was, I was, I was off-put. Seriously off-put. I was out of it. You know? Just out of it. Bloody, ugh. I don't know. Some people, the nerve, the nerve. It's a new ship, all right. You get, you get, a, you get a break. What do you do? Eat a sandwich, you know. You get a break. What do you do? I don't know. Go do something else. Go bloody, you know. Don't play tennis. I'm shocked. Anyway, I can't report them, cause you know, you're allowed to do what you want. You can do anything that you want, and it's it's kind of annoying. Anyone's allowed to do whatever the hell they want, so whatever, won't be reporting them, but still, I think it's a bit, uh, a bit, uh, a bit ridiculous to go and play tennis like that. I, I really don't like that sport. God. Plus the program that they were running. Oh. Oh, no. 
Oh my goodness, the sky was blue, that's alright, sky's blue, but that's that, the heat and the sun, why do you have it, oh, why do you have it bloody so sunny and so hot, eh? Can't you have the weather overcast, just a bit of, a bit of clouds, have it, a, you know, a bit of a breeze, make it a nice, cool game of tennis, you know, refreshing. I don't know, I don't know, clueless, just clueless people, anyway. These people are working for me. This is my new crew. Tennis lovers. Tennis lovers. Oh, they're all radicals. Radicals, I'll tell you what. That's us. Hmm. Wait until the Admiral hears about this. Alright. Okay. End log.